afternoon. It's 3.33 in the afternoon and I'm headed out. I'm actually gonna go Gadesia and we're gonna go to Sam's Club. She's looking for a camera. And we don't know what Sam's Club have because we never looked or paid attention to the cameras. So we're gonna go see what they have. Then I'm gonna drop her off and head to the gym. Today's another pretty chill day. It's Sunday. You know how you get on Sunday. You're just like super chill. Don't want to do much. But I need to go to the gym. And I don't have my kids. The kids club at the gym is actually not open on Sundays. So I couldn't go with them anyways. So yeah. I'll see you guys later. What? Oh, the little... What are those called? Tumblers. I didn't even see these. I was talking oh. about that shelf. Oh, the shelf. Oh, this is so cute. <laughs> What are those? I was talking about these. Oh, those are cups. Those are nice. Let me tell you. I went to um, Nordstrom's Rep. Mm -hmm. They had those cups. Each one was $14.99. Each individual what? cup was $14.99. Were they designer? So that, no, literally just plain rose gold cups. That's crazy. 14 because at first, because they were like stacked up. I'm like, oh, this is a bundle. Right, right. right. One. I go to check out. She's like, no, each individual. One. Oh, they She's out of their freaking like, mind. Oh, yeah, you tripping. Lost their mind. <laughs> we came to see what kind of cameras they had here or deals they had they for Deja. Because it doesn't even the, have the, the lens. The lens on there. So Maybe camera. the bundle. Like, huh? Comes with the lens. So fuzzy. Yeah. Maybe the bundle comes with the lens. I wonder what comes in the bundle. Having maybe I should put on my face. So Aubrey's having a sleepover, <laughs> and I'm trying to decide what will the kids sleep on because we have hardwood floors. And why did I look at these dog beds? Why are these dog beds so comfortable? They're like memory foam. So I'm trying to find like an air mattress. Um, not seeing any air mattresses. Where is the machine that you use here? You pop your card in, a free sample comes out. I'm trying to tell her that it's people that stand at the carts and hand you free samples. Really? I know that. Yes. She swears. Yes, it's a machine. It's yeah, Have any of y'all ever heard of a machine that pops yes, out free samples yes, at Sam? Have. You put the card in. Never heard it of says it. says one moment and pops it out. There you go, and it's one sample per card. Okay. I don't know where she's been. I'm telling you guys, I Says so the person it. that doesn't have a Sam's Club card. I, you know, I'm not trying to hear none of that. <laughs> <laughs> she said, boom, but what's that? <laughs> I've never seen this before. Mm -hmm. I don't know what this is. What's, what's your what? What's your higgle? Hi, G. This is what I'm talking. That's a prescription machine, you oh. dumb dumb. <laughs> Talk about a machine that pops out free samples. This man filling his prescription. <laughs> I need to get out this door with you. Now where the hell do we park? Let me know if you hear it. I'm pressing the lock button. I see it right there. Oh, that's it. Oh, I didn't hear it. <laughs> Oh, it's so cold. It's so cold. <sighs> Don't do it. Don't do it. What? So why? Why? Why would he have his daughter out there today? Well, what if he does? You know that movie with Will Smith and he had his son? Uh huh. Yeah. What if that's his situation? And he ain't got nowhere to take his daughter. Here's my opinion. 
this is just my opinion. This is just me personally. And I actually got this because I used to be the same way. I would see somebody outside and I would always, this is why I always had cash. I would always give them cash. Mm -hmm. Now the only people I give cash to is the people with the bells. Mm -hmm. I make sure every store I go into I have a couple of dollars for them. Right. I was told if it is a man and he is homeless, man has too many opportunities. If you see a woman who is homeless, you always give to a woman because you never know what she's going through. A man will make things work as a man. That's just what I was told, and a man told me that. <sighs> That's the only reason why I personally don't give to a man. And then, you heard about all them stories in Julia Patch, when them people don't even be nothing wrong with them, just be trying to get some extra money for the holidays, or any time. <coughs> Deja. Diane. But what if it's really something wrong with them, and we just drove away in a warm, nice car, they're outside see, in the I don't see nobody else behind us, so the front of us giving money neither. Mm -hmm. And you know we drove past him and we were here. Oh, we did? Mm hmm I didn't see that. I feel bad. You really feel bad? Mm hmm Diane! I do! <laughs> <laughs> I just feel like... There's too many shelters out here. Just in Joliet alone. Okay, but shelters aren't nice. Would you rather be on the streets or in a shelter? In a shelter. But maybe he was like a few dollars away from getting a hotel room for the night or something. I don't know. But, I mean, I never give them like an insane amount of money. Because uh -huh. you never know what they're doing with the money. Okay. But then you never know... You never know what their intentions are, and I just feel like a few dollars isn't gonna break me. Mm -hmm. So I'd rather give them the money and they have it if they really need it. Mm -hmm. And if they don't, I mean, that's on them. That's mm -hmm. their karma to deal with. So I always feel bad if I don't give them money because that wouldn't have broke me. I would still have my nice. But then don't, car then don't, home. Listen, don't listen to me no more. I know you, Debbie yeah. Downer. Yeah, I swear to oh, God. That poor man. <laughs> Oh, I let her get in my head, guys. I, I guess. Poor man, Ben. The most I ever gave somebody, I gave this woman twenty dollars. She was downtown Chicago. She was crying and she was huge and pregnant. She was huge, like about to pop. Oh yeah, I would have gave her a lot of money she too. She was pregnant, like. Really pregnant. I went to and she was right in front of a Walgreens. I went, I got bought a candy bar, and got cash back. I felt so bad. Mm, that's sad. <coughs> homeless and pregnant. Man, I've instantly felt pregnant. Pregnant is hard to deal with on its own, but homeless and pregnant, I couldn't even imagine. Urgh, why can't everybody be good? Honestly, like, if there were, like, no bad intentions in the world, I would give to all. Right. Seriously. Me too. But honestly, with so many people just being shady, I can't do it. Because I could have gone to somebody who really needed it. Mm -hmm. That's why I never give them too much. Mm -hmm. Like, enough. Like, I wouldn't give him them, like, $20. I wouldn't give them, like, 50 uh -huh. I'd probably give them, like, $5 at the moment. I'd probably give them a meal and give them money to go buy more liquor. Yeah. But I feel like they buy the liquor to stay warm. So I'm just so torn. I'm like, I just they buy liquor to stay warm. Yeah, you know, girl, like, they alcoholic. Get oh. out of here. <laughs> I don't want to assume. <laughs> I don't want to assume. So this one guy, I just gave him a Subway sandwich, and I felt I was like, uh, can I get him a ham and cheese, a spicy Italian? If and he's <laughs> homeless, he is not picky. <laughs> he just hungry. I have to tag you in this video on mm -hmm. Facebook. Um, this guy just walked, he walked up to like a whole bunch of homeless people, like if you had one, if you could get one gift for Christmas, you know, what would it be? And like he would just get all the, you know, homeless people reactions. Uh -huh. And they were like simple things and it just made me like appreciate stuff. We out here asking for like laptop, Mac laptops mm -hmm. and iPhones and stuff. And they, they was actually, I don't even remember half the stuff they asked for. Mm -hmm. One lady said a blanket, one lady said... Um, this man said a phone charger because he has a phone, uh -huh. but it's not on or anything. He just wants to turn it on. Uh -huh. Like it was just like a little simple stuff, and I'm just like, hey, look at us out here expecting to get the world, right. and they just I don't know. I feel like homeless people are like some of the most 
humble, humble list. Is Wait, that a word? Humble list people. Maybe because they, they don't have anything, but still, uh -huh. like, it just makes you appreciate the things that you do have. Because something so simple could make them happy, and they all had. Right. And he went and brought them all what they asked for, and they all were so happy. <laughs> now, what you come out the house with, Deja? <laughs> I came with a palette I don't use. She but doesn't use. I got in a whole naked Urban Decay palette that she just doesn't use. Who? Who? Why? What? When? Where? How? <laughs> just dropped Deja off. I'm on my way to the gym. Got my pre-workout ready. I'm ready to get it. Remember my headphones today because last time I went to the gym I forgot my headphones. Today I have them. I'm ready. About to get pumped up. I need to start working out consistently again because I've been slacking and I've been eating like, I wouldn't say eating bad, but I've just been eating so much that I'm not burning enough to keep up with, you know, a good weight. So, and plus you just want to stay healthy and stay in shape. We get old, I'm not old, but as we get older, you know, you just want to stay in shape and keep your body in shape. And trust me, it gets harder as you get older. I'm not even that old and it's harder for me to work out now than it was before. So. Yep, on my way to the gym. About to get this workout cracking, cracking, cracking. I'm super pumped. I'm excited to go to the gym today. And they don't even have workout classes on Sunday, so I'm working out by myself and I'm pumped up. I'm ready. Let's go. So I'm leaving the gym, seven o'clock on the dot. I had an awesome workout. Um, I've never been to the gym, well, this gym, on a Sunday, and it was pretty empty. I like that. So I'm, even though Sunday's like a family day, Maybe I can come late like this. Um, I don't know. I like coming to the gym when there's not a lot of people there. Be two weeks to your birthday. Still, still two, still two weeks. It's almost your Sunday. Birthday. It's gonna be three more weeks. Sunday. The last day, like today. It's gonna be one week. Next Sunday. One okay. week. Yeah. Turn up. Into my birthday. Turn up, turn up. Are you gonna turn up on your birthday? Huh? I'm happy. You gonna turn up on your birthday? What does that mean? What does turn up mean? You know what turn up means. Be hyped, turned up, get excited. You know, turn up. Uh, yeah. I like, I like the music. Yay, today's my birthday! <laughs> We are ending the vlog here. We're all showered. We're gonna call it a night. Good night. Ready for bed. Arbor has school in the morning. You excited? Mm -hmm. You excited? Yeah. I'm okay. ready for daily five. Okay. So, good night. Yeah. That's my brother. I know you see. <laughs> <laughs> I know y'all seen that shadow. <laughs> I ain't gonna say what else, but I know y'all seen that shadow. Yeah, that was my brother. I don't see that shadow. It was on us. So good night, guys. See you tomorrow for day. I don't even know what day it is. I was thrown off a vlog, so I was two vlogs behind because Shawan had took the camera all day one day, and I didn't have the video footage to upload the video, so I did not. So yeah. Maybe it's Vlogmas Day 2. Tomorrow I mean, is going to be day 11. Yeah. And I have to upload 9 and 10 still. <laughs> well, we'll see you guys next time. Good night. Good night.